Uh, let's do some preview. So, loser this leaves is, town. This is oh, you have a loser. I, ha- leaves town? I actually have just a loser leaves my brain. Loser leaves the NFL and is relegated to the MLS. I like this because I think we probably have the same Redskins, oh, Dolphins. Oh, oh, I had okay. So I broke it down. I have a loser leaves town game, but I I had we have two toilet bowls. This week. Okay, we have the Redskins, Dolphins as a toilet bowl, and we have the Falcons, Cardinals as a toilet bowl. Yeah, so this is not the best slate of games. The Texans Chiefs is probably the best game early. It's a really good game. You know what's my brain? And don't is, worry, those two quarterbacks are fine. Whatever they were, they drafted the same year. Yeah, what year was that? Who was the who was drafted ahead? You know of what? Okay, can I say this real quick? Because it's bullshit. Here comes Trig Cat. Nope. Jo- uh, what's his name? <laughs> Solomon Thomas. Uh huh. The pick that the 49ers made. He can't even get on the field. A, he plays quarterback too. He can't. No, he can't oh, even he get on the he field. He's the third pick. Okay, Mitch plays quarterback. The Browns could have. Dra- the Browns were drafting first. They could have had one of those guys. That's I'm trying true. to change the narrative. That the Browns were the ones who. Ma- Wait, by taking our friend Baker. No, Miles Garrett. Oh, Miles Garrett. That's right. That was Miles Garrett. Yeah, yeah. Draft. My bad. All right, so uh, I have a loser leaves town game. Okay. Also, I think if you guys didn't trade for it, that's where it's really like if you okay, guys just but, had the pick and you shut made up. it. It's one shut thing, up. but the fact that you're like, we need to trade up. Not that it was a good decision. But, but the 49ers took Solomon Thomas. He stinks. But they didn't need a quarterback. But he stinks. Loser leaves town. Broncos Titans. Season is over for the loser of this I game. I think the Broncos season's already over. Ah, you're gonna you're gonna quit on your boy? Oh my Vic Fangio? No. Joe Flacco. No, uh, Joe Flacco, I'm a Joe Flacco realist. Okay? If 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 he is he's Whoa. Huh? Yeah, Whoa. yeah. Listen, I I, am, I believe in him. To Breaking an extent, news. I believe him to an extent. He's like Philip Rivers. If Philip Rivers could actually throw that fourth quarter touchdown that gives them the lead, the problem is Philip Rivers team, can't throw it anymore. He either. doesn't. He doesn't. And well, Joe Flacco still can, but his defense gives it up. Patriots just blocked a punt. Okay, so that was my loser leaves is town. That Winovich? Chase, wouldn't Shout you say Chase. though? He's changing the narrative around chases as we speak. Great wouldn't you flow. say? I like the Titans. Awesome flow. I like the Titans in this game because you got to take the underdog when they're when the Titans are underdogs. You got to take them. But wouldn't you say if the Titans lose this game, it feels a little bleak? Yeah, I think they're done. Right. So, all right. So that was my loser leaves town. Did you have a loser leaves town? Uh, no, just my loser, loser leaves is the... done with football. It becomes a F U T B O L team. Also, a reminder to everyone: we have an, a true London game. This this week, mm-hmm. make sure you get your bet in because nine thirty comes faster than you think. That's right. Put it in the night before. And I'm only giving myself, I'm allocating myself two Arians aerial attack in London jokes that I'm making. Well, this you're going to be all the way on the West Coast. You're not going to be. That's true. I'm. Uh, that's going to be six a.m. You, you need to set them as schedule auto, them. A schedule yeah. the tweets. Yeah, I will. I'll, I'll put them in in Hootsuite and get them ready to go. <laughs> not the first time an Arians has struggled with an aerial attack in London, so, folks. So everyone can everyone can just uh, <laughs> reply just hope, to that. Just hope. Just drop it for like. Yeah. Everyone reply I mean, you to think, it. You think Jameis Winston is going to play well in London? He's no. probably not even allowed in the country. So schedule for like seven fifteen West Coast time, and then maybe one for like ten thirty. Do the exact same tweet, and then everyone uh-huh. just replies, "Scheduled tweet PFT." Yeah, there you go. It's going to be weird watching this game, not even in America. <laughs> yeah, because I'm going to be in in Canada, in Vancouver, in Vancouver. Oh, so they even have? Yeah, it? you're not going to be able to watch it, dude. Yeah, they'll have NFL games, and I'll be loudly explaining to all the CFL fans the Where? different rules. Now this is I called. Don't think they have TVs. I'm just going to ask everybody. But I meet with a rouge is. I don't know if you. I don't know if you should be that confident. Oh, sorry, we don't have TVs now. He's, we've he's got ups, upset right we've now. We've got a he's beaver who he's going to the accent cho- because he knows he we, might. We've got a beaver that chews a lot of. You're wake up definitely. You're wake up like still drunk. Yeah, yeah, the, and then you, be on like a Reddit stream on your phone. The hotel. You think the hotel in Canada has the NFL network? That's a good. Well, I'm not in a hotel. <laughs> oh, there you I'm go. In a house. Even worse. It's oh, a log yeah. cabin. <laughs> yeah, you know Canadians local. I'm in a log. Have. I'm in a log cabin that's uh, that's heated by just like a, a, a fireplace filled with so syrup. You just listen to PFT's poutine. brain just panic and just go right to an accent when we when we showed him the fact that he might not be able to watch every NFL so, game. So if there's not a Monday part of my take, it's because I didn't. They don't allow computers in Canada. They yes. think that they're tools of the devil. There is Monday part of my take. We will record it and it will be great. Um, uh, okay, so let's do some picks. Favorites. Hank. Wait, are we sure they're good? Oh, you have one. Because I've got the 49ers and the Rams, and are we sure they're good? So the You're f- still thinking the 49ers might not be good? Well, the 49ers lost a very key component to their attack in Monday night. They mm. lost their fullback. Jushik. 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 Yeah. And then they brought in like seven fullbacks to try out this week. I don't know who they end up going with. 
Um, but they're going to struggle to fill that role because Jusic is really, really good. Correct. And they use him in a way that is kind of key to their offense. They might put Kittle in there to do some of the blocking stuff that he's been doing. I don't know. Uh, but they had, I think they had like Rupkowski. Giants first down. Giants first down. There's one of them. Um, they Should had, we reveal now? Yeah, okay. I have three. I, can I finish with fullbacks? Yeah, I have one. Is that okay? You have one. You can at least pretend that well, you're listening. Big Cat interrupted about first. I was, I was, I was piggybacking no, 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 keep going talking about the fullbacks. I don't know. They had, a, they had a shit Big Cat, of I wouldn't have interrupted that if Big Cat hadn't first. No, no. I want to hear the my full, my my whole point is the rushing fullbacks. attack is not going to have the same fullback this time. And they had a lot of full. What is a what's the collective term for a group of fullbacks? You know, it's a murder. Happy we let you finish that. Full by. It's a murder of crows. It's a full by. It's a it's a rush more of fullbacks. Yeah, they brought uh, in a rush. How many first back. downs you have the Giants on have? the count of three? Say it all. I, we already we'll, said it. Oh, we said I, I said three. I, I was Hank talking about one. fullbacks. Oh, I had five. Okay. Uh, all right. So you're <laughs> oh you that was your loser leaves. No, that's or no, my, sure Are we sure they're good? Because I don't know if the Rams are still good. I actually would argue that there's a half of an are we sure they're good game in the Texans going oh, to the Chiefs. Two. If the Texans win that game. I will consider the Texans very good. Okay. Wouldn't you agree? You, would per, you will personally consider the Texans very good. Yes. Okay. Eh, very good seems strong. I think they're very good if they beat the Chiefs. Good-ish. This In between could, good be and very good. I could see this being a trap game, though, where the Chiefs are banged up. The Texans could win this game, and then they meet in the playoffs, and the Chiefs win by 40. Yeah. Oh, I like that, Hank. Okay. Uh, Hank, give us your favorite. My favorite is going to be uh, the Chargers. Really? Yeah. Call, call me, call me, uh, call me Libwood. But the fact that like Mason Rudolph, they're letting him like take snaps and he's practicing. He might start on what? Sunday. What? Duck? How do you not start? Do you know Ducks in AWL? I know that. Yeah. But that's what I'm saying. Duck I, I just assume that he's. But I've seen a bunch of reports. They're letting Mason Rudolph take stats, take snaps. What does this have to do with Libwood? I just feel like people are like, oh, like it's a liberal take. Concussions. Like, oh, are, yeah. Concussions have a well-known left-leaning bias. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Belief in concussions. Yes. Belief in concussions. I believe all Democrats. Believe I believe that if you get exist. knocked out while you're playing, you should probably take minimum a week off. The fact that right, that's even right. might not happen. All right, socialist Chargers. Hank. Hopefully someday we'll get to a point where we can cross the party line and agree concussions are real. Mm -hmm. Both sides. AOC would bipartisan politics. Mm -hmm. Concussions are real. Uh, <laughs> all right, uh, PFT. What's your favorite? My favorite is Jacksonville minus one and a half at Ooh. home against the Saints. This is a game that. I, I'm just perplexed by this line. My my dumb brain can't wrap itself Vegas zone. around. Is that what it's called? No. Okay. I don't <laughs> I, I don't know what the Vegas zone is. No one does. Okay, the Jacko the Jacko zone. Um one and a half point favorites at home against New Orleans. I get there's home field advantage and I get that Minshew Magic is good and he's gonna make me wanna go out and light a nope. hand grenade on fire on <laughs> Bourbon Street and then pour it into I'm not gonna finish that. Okay. Part. Uh but <laughs> I, I get that there's the Minshew magic going on. I get it's a home game, but still, the Saints just feel like they should be favored in this game. And, Correct. And they're not, so obviously my brain is stupid, so I'm going against my brain. I like that. I like that. All right, uh, my favorite is going to be – I was going to go with the Rams, but it, but that fullback speech you gave me makes me a little nervous. <laughs> yeah. I'm not going to lie. Yeah. Uh, I'm gl you're I'll glad stick you with let the me Rams. finish. I'll stick with the Rams minus three. I think the Rams are going to – I think it's just a classic NFL situation where one team really needs a win and one team doesn't. Okay. Like the, the 49ers don't need this win. The Rams need this win. Also, it's a short week for the 49ers. That's true. And it's a long week for the Rams. <laughs>